Ooh, that armor must be difficult to polish. The next time you take your armor off and find it a bit hard, I could help give it a quick rub for you. Alright, this looks a bit promising. Shrine of Periite. That didn't come out as intended. Is this Kesh? Oh, skill book. Let me read the skill book first. Ah, Kesh no the clean. No pilgrim, perhaps. You have come to go. How can I assist? Hmm? Um. Yeah, tell me a bit. Tell me about Periite. Oh. He is the pass in the wound. Oh, proper ones curl their noses, but it's pus that drinks foul humors and restores the blood. I worship Periite, yes, because sometimes the world can only be cleansed by disease. May I commune with Periite? Not everyone has the stomach required to entreat, my lord. But Cash likes you, friend. There is a way Periite may speak to us. Who will take him in? If you wish to commune with him, we'll need the incense. Tell me about this incense. Yes, the incense. Fetch for me a death bell flower, one silver ingot, a flawless ruby, and some vampire dust. Then I will show you how. Great. Go and play fetch now then. Shouldn't be too hard to uh, get all of these. Oh, I've got the death bell flower. Right. Let's go and get vampire dust. What's the other bits? A vampire dust, silver ingot and a flawless ruby. Dag Nemit, where am I going to get those from? Anyone seen a vampire around here? <laughs> right, let's go and get this stuff and then... Uh, I'll be back to commune with Periite. Alright, Kesh, where are you? Still mixing ingredients. You must be one hungry cat. Got your stuff anyway. Hmm? Uh, I have the items you requested. Ah, have you? Let Kesh have them. Yes, yes. Sophia's photo bombing again. Loving the dragon in the background. Just hope it doesn't come this way. Where exactly are you going? Does drinking milk make me a milk drinker? Yes, shut up. I'm confused. I drink milk, but I'm also tough and drink as much meat as the other noise. Oh, there's a Dwee so Maroon over there. Me? Maybe we have to go and pay that a visit. Alright, so what's this fume he's on about? That's an amazing looking uh, shrine. That should do. I thought incense was forbidden. No, oh, wait a minute, that was incest. Inhale the fumes. By the way, Kesh, these are my fumes. Ew, what is that disgusting smell of that strange green goo? Come and have a sniff of it, Sophia. <laughs> Breathe deep, mortal. I would have you hear me well. So let these vapors fill your lungs. What do you want with me? I have watched you for some time, you know. The decisions you've made intrigue me. And I wonder if you of a proper agent for a task of mine. What task? I sent a blessing to Mundus. A wasting plague that infected a scattering of Breton villages. One of my monks, the elf or Chendor was sent to gather these afflicted. He shepherded them into Bathardons for me, but has since lost his way. 
I will not stand for betrayal. I want you to go to the Thardoms and kill Orchendor in my name. I've heard your request. Release me. So you have, mortal. Go now. Kill Orchendor. I care too much about you. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Let's not make this all awkward. I don't really do sentimental. Right, I guess we're off to Bathar Demps to kill this Orchendor. Still plenty of green goo if anybody wants to sniff it. Ah, oh, great. That's a nice trek. Past the dragon as well. Ah, uh, maybe that is it over there. Okay, so when we get to Bathar Dams, we will be back. Yeah, I'm getting a front wedge is too, Sophia. I have to walk it and all. Okay, so as always, I come at these things from a funny angle. I mean, this is Bethardems. No doubt there's a whole load of uh, bandits somewhere around here. Where are they? Come on, bandits. There we go, this one. Oh, they're afflicted and they're going to spit shit on me. That one ain't going to those, it. Had one piece of gold on him. What a little miser. Oh, where's the rest of you afflicted? I'm guessing that's it for now then. Oh. Come on! I love your orcish arrows though. Because I'm only using iron at the moment and they're absolutely bloody rubbish. I'm guessing it's up here I've got to go. No, it's down there. Now which lever is it? Is it going to be this one? Or that one? Well, you might want to come down, because I'll get this wrong. You're both going to get uh, chopped up into little pieces. No, nope, I got it right. Okay, let's go and find this Orchand, or whatever his name is. Give him a damn good seeing tool. Once I've uh, taken all the loot. Thardamps Upper District. Oh, it looks like we've got lots of green goo everywhere. Tribunal mask, ebony, and a flawless. I don't want to walk in it. Come on. Where's these afflicted? No, let's just get a little bit ready. In case I get ambushed. I get through here. You don't think the dwarves disappeared because they're all infants? You considered them obsolete and turned against them? It's a possibility, Sophia. I've heard some nasty stories about old Wemma ruins, or maybe they discovered some alternate universe. There's lots of theories on the Dwemer. Get that one while it's sleeping anymore. No. If they're all going to be asleep, they're not. Oh, shit. They're all going to spit stuff at me. I might not want to get so close to them.
Right, where are we going? It looks like I'm just going around in circles at the minute. So this room's obviously collapsed at some point. Hello. What I roll forwards for? I'm supposed to roll backwards. Sneaking behind them. Well, I didn't even get a bloody hit in that time. My followers are too powerful. Maybe I'll just fireball them. Maybe that's the best way of doing this. Nice. Green goo certainly has its effect, doesn't it? Get it, come here. Got me with a goo stuff again. Oh, just use my bow. David. Oh, didn't mean to shoot David, sorry. So we've got an afflicted child in here that I'm accidentally shooting. Hello, David. I don't want to. No, nope, not going to adopt you. That would be really disturbing if you did. Oh, right, what's this lever doing? Guessing it opens that up there. Yep, come on this way. Let's go through the big gold door, or is it bronze? Well, that one's dead. I'm guessing they trod on the pressure plate. Pressure plate. Oh, shit. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, I think he killed it. Not some not bad loot in here. Guess it is fairly leveled. Alright, do not tread on the pressure plate, otherwise you'll end up like her. Dead. Just run one. Well do me, thank you very much. Hey, she was only wearing farmer's clothes, so she's not really gonna put up too much of a defence, is she? To be fair, he's got barkeeper's clothes on, so yeah, not much uh, not much of a challenge. Weak magic of poison. Not really worth it. Go to the workshop. What was that? Someone there. There we go. We've got some more company, ladies. 
fit in there blooming goo on me. No! God, it takes so long to cast a healing spell. Is that their pet that I just killed? No idea. Afflicted's note. Orchenda has gone down to the airdrome. He believes some of the old Dweemer machines down there will help him commune with our blighted lord. Guess we're going down then. Guess <laughs> we're going down. <laughs> Unsent afflicted letter. Beloved Dufresne, I know you thought me a fool not to leave Cull Alu with you and the others, but I couldn't abandon our children to the wasting sickness. Whatever horrible fate you may have guessed for us, however, probably far from the truth of what has happened. I send this letter in hopes that it will soothe a worried mind. Maybe a week after you left with the rest of the healthy folk, I was patrolling the low wall by foot. Even our poor Kelter had taken illness and was unfit to ride. I was praying that no bandits would, bandits would be foolish enough to risk infection for our trifling goods. Then, outlined against the pyre light of the days lost, I saw a long figure marching towards the village. The stranger was a Somerset elf who introduced himself as Orchander, and with him came a change in destiny for the folk of Kul Alu. Orchenda walked among our people without fear of the wasting sickness that had taken root in the marrow of every remaining villager, myself included by now. For days he ate and spoke with us, learning each name. He calmed the folk in the way my lying prayers could not. Spirits became cheerful that days before I waited bleakly in the death's parlour. Orchenda assembled us then, crowding the villagers into Colette's barn, she being the most badly stricken at that time and are unable to move without being carried by Orchenda himself. The good elf then gave us tidings that none could have guessed. He claimed that the sickness was not a curse on our village, as we were sure it had been. Rather, Orchenda insisted it was a boon, a beacon which drew him to us. He then told us that he served the Daedric Prince Periite. I know what you're thinking, we burned Dina and Lucas not three years before after all. Kal Alu would never suffer the heresies of a Daedra worshipper in our midst, yet we did. Not only that, but we rapidly heard what he had to say. Maybe you think we were too sick, too weak, but we weren't. Orchenda apologised for our dead, saying he came with us. He came with all haste to Kal Alu. None had perished since his arrival, though several seemed on the brink in the hours before. He wanted to take us to a new home, a place where we could live out our days in worship of Peria as his chosen, as his afflicted. Nobody refused. Some were carried in carts and litters, but all made the trek with Orchenda across the border into Skyrim leaving Kal Alu an empty haunted place. We have since lived in refuge, the ruins of an ancient dwarven city. Other afflicted live with us, many with similar tales to that of Kal Alu, bound together by a divine infection. Though you could say we are all sick, the effects of the sickness no longer diminish us, they give us strength. We heal ourselves with liquors and tinctures that other men would call poison. Orchenda keeps us safe here by the blessing of our Prince Periite. I am now Apostle of the Afflicted, tasked to disseminate the teachings of Periite to our afflicted. And so, sweet Dufresne, the spirit of Kal Alu lives on. I will never blame you for abandoning us that day, now long past. In truth, I am saddened that you are not likewise chosen by Periite. In truth, I am saddened that you are not likewise chosen by Periite to wake with these oozing lungs. Periite preserve you, dear husband, and know your children are well. Well, at least we know how everyone bloody call this disease now. Well, not how they caught it, but what happened. Where they all came from. Oh, crud. There's quite a few of these spiders. Yeah, right, once we finish buzzing and zapping. Yeah, you got a bit of a headache after that, haven't you? Guess we want to go that way, but let's have a little little look in here first. Didn't expect that, did you? And that's what you get.
not got a huge amount, have they? Huge amount of goods. Upper district. Yep, this is the way. Hang on, so what's through the other door? Right, quest marker's telling me to go this way, so we will. Looks like Fungus the bogey man has been here with his snot and bogey pie. Mmm, nice. Alright, found to be an ambush around here somewhere. There we go. Avoid that green spit stuff. I am. Are you? All right. It's getting a little bit tougher now, isn't it? Don't want to loot them all. No. Can't bother. I haven't got anything decent on them anyway. So where am I going? Ah, I'm guessing we're going up. Come on ladies, we're going up. But I thought Orchando had gone down. Certainly a decent view up here, isn't there? All the bits I've missed. <laughs> Through the next door. Where's this going to? The lower district. We get another ambush. If the magic didn't wake him up, Howling Wolf will. Right, so while I'm busy looting, my uh, followers are stuck in battle. Oh, watch out for the steam. Is it deadly steam? Probably. Turn the dream up. I think we're done. Me and David again, or another kid. How many kids they got down here? Uh, I'm probably not going to want to take this somewhere. Gold, scintillating iron boots. Yeah. As everyone is proving so troublesome. Nice little, it's almost like an arena, this bit. I'll see you in pieces. That sounds like someone's taken on a Dwarven Centurion. Good there. Uh, let's keep pressing on. Still gotta find this ore chander. Oh. 
Alright, so left a pretty obvious trap there. What do you the lever does? Oh! Don't get pressing levers. Uh, don't you press a button to pull a lever? Alright. Uh, just follow these platforms around. It's got to be around here somewhere. What's in here? The study. This sounds promising. No, looking at the quest mark, we've got another room we've got to go through. Just rob them while they're not here. Do not press them buttons. A little bit sketchy. Cast my oak flesh, give myself a bit more, uh, increase my armor rating. Right, is this the last area we need to go to? Lower district. That's where we went. Where are they? There they are. Right, let's see if I can get a nice sneaky shot in here first. And I'm backing up, ready for the vomitology. That vomit is dangerous stuff, man. And I guess my two-hander is as well. Nice little pile of bodies. Must be getting close to Orchanda now. Gotta be. I'm sure we've been through most of this um this dilemma ruin by now. Killed enough of his afflicted as well. One more door. The Arcanix. Ugh. Hello Ilya. You're looking rather ravishing today. Fancy killing a boss? Well, we're going to fight him. There's always something down there we have to fight as soon as we go into a new area. Oh, a little worker spider. Got a little buddy. Another one coming in over there. <laughs> so, oh my god! I have a feeling that that is you doing that to me, isn't it? Oh, that stupid frost spell. Some good stuff on it though. Just gonna loot these. Where's the other one? Down there. Excuse me a minute while I take this out. These these caverns are absolutely amazing. Let's just stop and have a look. Okay, let's carry on then. It's enough looking at the scenery. Oh, we got down here then. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh 
hell even is that thing? Oh, this is not going particularly well. I'm just going to stand back here, arrange this thing. No, 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 no. Right, no, no stamina. Christ, it's following me down here. I didn't think it would do that. Get a distraction, please, doggy. That is hard. Dwarven Keeper Centurion. Shit. Do not want to see too many of those. Last arrow, though. Not going to argue with that. And there's something else wants to be taken out as well. I think we managed to get them all this time. That was one hard battle. One I do not want to repeat. Thank you very much. Somewhere in here is the baddie. Oh my life, he's tough. Jesus Christ, I can't even can't close with him, can't range him. Gotcha, you, you son of a bitch. Report or Chandra's death to Periite. Well, he's dead. Key to the elevator. And we haven't been killed by a nasty disease yet, so I'm assuming Peri Yeah, in a minute, in a minute. Take that, take that. Yeah, we'll take that one. The ID is pleased with us. I see a reward coming away. I think you're probably right. I wonder why the Dunmer are called Dark. Right, that's enough you had it yesterday. It makes them sound really evil. Alright, so a little sniff of fumes and see what Periot's got to say. Well done, mortal. All things are in their order. And Orchendo roams the pits. His betrayal will be punished, and your obedience is rewarded. What happens now? Go, seek your fate. I will be watching, and perhaps we will meet again afterwards. Very well. Goodbye. Embrace order and hard truth, mortal. Goodbye. Oh, 
Okay, so that gets me Spellbreaker. While blocking creates a ward that protects against spells for up to 50 points. Been done with this while I was in Bethardems. Getting spat up by them blooming horrible things. There we go then. So that's uh, the afflicted sorted out. Not sure what we're going to do next. Got the whole of Skyrim. That's our feet. Well, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give a video a like. And don't forget to subscribe and follow on to see more of our uh, adventures through Skyrim. That's Bethard Amps over there. And I just noticed all the way over there, there's another Dwemer Ruin. Maybe we'll even go and visit that. Who knows? Find another follower. If there's anything you would like to see me do, don't forget to drop it in the comments. Uh, for now, see you all soon. Take care now. Bye bye. Sophia, what are you doing?